Good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher Kike. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Sure. How are you, Alma? Sure. Hello, Christopher. Good evening, Mr. Hello, Hello George. Hello, Kenya. Cecil, good, good evening. Hello, Norma. Hello, Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hey, I'm really happy to see you. Thank every you. Sing, every single night, it's like uh, an adventure for everybody, right? <laughs> I hope you're doing good, that you're you're having a great time at home. And you know, we are just getting ready for uh, our fourth session, right? So today, Thursday, tomorrow, uh, we're not uh, having English classes, but you see, today we're going to take advantage of time. It will be 60 minutes, pure English, okay? Yeah. Let's give some minutes. All right, let's give some minutes for people to gather. I only have 12 people connected. I'm still waiting for Wilson got into the class. Hello, Wilson. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, Don't forget to activate your yeah. camera, okay? Try to activate hey, you your camera. If you, all right, so if you have some problems, uh, technical problems, let me know about it, okay? But if you don't have any pro any any problem, do me a favor to activate your camera. It's quite important for us to see you, okay? Good evening, teacher. Hello, hello, Jose. How are you doing? Just fine. Thumbs up. All right, thumbs up. Yesterday we were talking about body, uh, I mean parts of the body, right? We could notice about finger, thumb, uh, eyes, ears, stomach, and we also started something related to, to some illnesses, right? When you, we don't feel that good, so the we can take some pills. So yesterday you told me, right, that you... Whenever you have whenever you have a problem with your stomach, you you go and take a yodoclorina, you said yesterday, right? Is that right? Alcade. <laughs> Absolutely Alcade, right? Alcade, yodoclorina. Some some people told me Pepto, right? Pepto. Yeah, but the thing is that whatever <laughs> you drink, it, it's it's for you good. I mean, if you feel all right, it's okay. Okay, today we are going to, to start, or oh, we will continue, okay, it's 8 o'clock, time to start. Let's get down to business and let's see what's going on with the lesson today. Uh, I don't know if you could see the, 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 the link I shared in the WhatsApp group today. If you couldn't, no problem. I mean, I sent it to you, or I shared it with you like an hour before getting into the class so that you can get familiar, familiarized with the topic, okay? But if you couldn't, okay, you can see it later. It says, Fatima says, teacher, oh, it's because, oh, all right. So Fatima, Elisa, Marroquin. Okay, I will check it now in here, Fatima. Thanks for letting me know. I, I can see that you are present, but you have difficulties okay, thank to, you. to participate, okay, all right. Okay, guys, let's go over the lesson today. And I hope, and I hope that you are more than ready because time to practice. Remember, the purpose for being over here is to practice English fully, all right? And let me see, this is, so wait a no, this is not the, the basic, but this is intermediate. Let's go over the, the, the basic structure okay and as you can see over here uh, today we are in church of talking about negative uh, positive and negative imperatives all right so we're going to discover what's what is that what are imperatives uh, it is something very simple it is very easy to learn i know that you have already used this structure and I know it will be quite easy, but anyways, we we need to go the top, go through the topic, and we uh, have to practice a little bit. Is that all right? 
By the end of this lesson, you will hear how to use positive and negative imperatives. Additionally, you will also practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in real life setting. Okay, so let us go over it. I hope that you are ready. I hope you are ready, more than ready, all right? Because we are going to go over this uh, conversation, okay? I think you don't have problems. I already uh, checked the video and we can see the information quite well. Let's go. Hi, everyone. In this class, you learn how to use positive and negative imperatives. Additionally, you'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled Don't Work Too Hard. Let's listen and practice. All Don't right. work too hard. Remember, what is your job now? Your job now is to pay special attention and later you are going to repeat, right? And of course, you have to understand everything you read. Okay, that is your job now. Hello, Ms. West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. The conversation that we just heard illustrates the conversation between a doctor and a patient. Now take a look at Typically, the imperative, please. whenever we are sick and we go to the doctor, we're going to receive instructions from the doctor so that we can get better. We use imperatives to give instructions. Imperatives. Take a pill every four hours. All right, take Rest a pill every four bed. hours. Rest in bed. I Drink hope that you are of juice. Uh, practicing at home. Drink lots don't of juice. Don't work too hard. Don't work too hard. Don't stay up late. Don't stay up late. Don't drink soda. Don't drink soda. Okay. To form imperatives is very simple. Just add the verb. Take the no verb. subject is necessary. Then a compliment. Take a pill every four hours. On the hours. left hand side of the chart, we can see positive imperatives. Let's analyze them. Positive. Take a pill every four hours. The verb is take. The complement is a pill every four hours. On the right hand side of the chart, we have any negative. negative imperatives. Don't work too hard. In this case, we're going to follow this next formula. Don't plus verb plus complement. Have a look or take a look at this. Quite Don't. important. Don't. I mean, keep concentrated, people. This is quite work, important. Verb, Don't work. And the complement too hard. Too hard is a compliment. Don't now, work. I would like for you to give some examples of your own. Think of the advice or instructions that you or your doctor gives whenever you have some kind of illness. For example, if you have a cold, take cough syrup. Cough syrup. Don't drink cold drinks. Don't drink cold drinks. After you finish this task, share your work in our discussion forums. All right. So actually, this is the first part of the video. I mean, this is the whole video and there is an activity at the end, right? Uh, as you can see, the, the imperative start with the verb. Take a pill every, every four hour. Rest in bed. Drink lots of juice. Uh, see the video. Uh, study hard work hard etc but if you want to say something in a native form an imperative in a native form you need to include don't at the beginning don't drink too much soda that is unhealthy all right don't work too much don't go to, don't stay up late or don't go to bed late etc okay now something that we're gonna go and we're going to keep working uh, on is and on pronunciation imperatives by listening to a... All right, something that we're gonna learn is 
to practice pronunciation. Uh, do me the favor, don't forget, don't forget to, to close your microphone if you are not um, participating. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, listen carefully because uh, we're gonna try to do it in a different, in different rates. I mean, in different uh, rhythm, rhythm, okay? Now, first we're gonna listen to it normally. Okay? Conversation title. Normally. Don't listen work too hard. And try to practice it. Let's listen at and home. practice. Don't okay? work too hard. Don't work too hard. Okay, now listen carefully. You, you have to, you have to, um, Repeat everything. Here we go. Hello, Ms. West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. Take part. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. The All right. Now, uh, uh, let's, let's get back to this. And let me see. This was, I, I mean, it was normally, right? So you can, you can play the track by... Uh, using different rhythms, uh, we're gonna try with this one, and then you will Today. see. Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. I'm gonna give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. All right. That was another rhythm. Now, you can play the track once again and play it in a, in a faster way. Let us try with this one. Listen. Today. Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay. Let's take a look at you. All right. So and we're going to be playing with that. Now, with different rhythms, okay, normally, this is normally, right? So later, 1.25 and later 1.50. But if you wanna, if you wanna play the track or the video uh, slowly, you can do it also. Hello, Ms. West. How are you today? All right, so listen carefully. Um, let me see. Oh, I, I can see Alma over here. Alma, you will choose the rhythm. Uh, you have three options: slow, slowly, normal, or fast. Lo vamos a practicar. Ustedes van a elegir tres formas. Lo van a decir. Si usted dice slowly, entonces lo dicen lento. Si lo dice normally, normal, or you you read it fast. O lo, o lo dicen rápido. All right. Alma, Alma, so here. Alma Aguirre, okay. Alma, and I also have Jorge David. Choose, choose, please, the rhythm. I do. I yeah. do, Jorge. Okay, okay, Jorge David, choose the rhythm. I am. You will start, but you, you will be Dr. John. And Alma okay. will be uh, Miss Quest. You have three options, okay? Slowly, normally, or fast. Slowly. Normally. Normally. <laughs> okay. Normally, okay. 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 You will read it uh, uh, normally. All right. Here we go. You will read. Uh, you will read it um, just right now, okay? At one, at two, and at three. Hello, Mr. Quest. How are you today? Not so good. So what are wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Um, why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. 
I am going to give you some pills. Say one pill every night after dinner. Okay. I don't drink coffee, tea or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All wow. right. Thanks, Dr. Jung. Fantastic. I mean, normally, right? So, but listen to me. You say uh, dinner. You don't say diner, okay? So you say dinner. Dinner. Yeah, that's right. So you say dinner. Normally, okay. So what's fantastic? Okay. Normally, uh, then we have Julio Cesar. Julio, you want to participate? Julio Cesar? Yes. Yeah, all right. You only have two options. Slowly or fast. Uh, okay, Julio Cesar, and let me see another person. Kenya. Kenya. Okay, Kenya, choose. You have only two options because normally, was, I mean, somebody else uh, chose it. Mm. Yes. Slowly. Uh, slowly. All right. Uh, do you agree, Julio, or do you want to do it yes. fast? No, slow. Uh, slowly. slowly. All right. So. Okay, a one, a two, and a three. You start, Julio. Hello, Mr. West. How are you today? Not so good. So what ground exactly? I'm exhausted. Mm, why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay. Let's take a look at you. I am going to give you some pills. Take on pills every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All right, thanks, Dr. Young. <laughs> All right, wow, that was fantastic. I mean, slowly, slowly, right? Hey, do me the favor to repeat the following words, please. Uh, George, uh, no, Julio and Kenya, wrong. 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 W, wrong. Uh, you don't pronounce the W. You say wrong, wrong. Mm. Right? Wrong, wrong. wrong. Yeah. Tired. 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 Just. Just. Can't. 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 I'm. 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 One. 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 All right. Very good. So you did a great job. Now we're almost we, we will we will go over the, the activity itself. Huh? I want to listen two people more, but to, these two people are in church of uh saying the activity in a really fast way, okay? Fa quickly, you're gonna read the information quickly. Let me see. I need two I need two volunteers. Volunteers, yeah, me sure. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, Diana. Diana, let me see in. Yeah, I, yeah, I did her. Uh, uh, let me see. I have uh, well, a lot of people want to participate. That's really good. Diana uh, and Sylvia, all right. Diana and Sylvia. Let's see. Diana and okay. Sylvia. Sylvia. All right. Okay. Give me one second, please. Diana and Sylvia. Pretty good. So, hey, you know, you have to say pretty, pretty fast, okay? This is like, okay, teacher. You, you don't have, uh, again? you can start. Okay, <laughs> you start with, with Dr. John. Uh, yeah. All right. Okay. Yes, I'm fine. Yes, I'm fine. Okay. Not so good. So what's wrong, Sally? Okay, give me I one second. Give me one second. So good. I'm so sorry. I'm so, so sorry. what's give, wrong exactly? Give me one second. Give me one second, please, because this is the fast. This is the fast version. Okay, so you 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 will be like, "Hello, Miguel. How are you today?" 
That's a good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. So let us try to do it like that. I mean, it will be kind of difficult, but this is the fast version. It's all right. So you will start once again, Diana. Amanda? You do the favor to start. Yeah, please. And try to do it faster. Okay. Hello, Miss West. How are you today? Not so good. What happened? I don't listen. Silvia, quizás no escuchó, no sé. Not so good. Solo una se hay. Oh, maybe Silvia is facing problems with microphone. Hola. Hola. Hello, hello, Silvia. Silvia. Me escucha. Yeah, that's right. Now, yes. Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Let's take out at you. Uh, okay. Oh. You, you continue. I, I am. Yo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm going to give to. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pills every night after dinner. Okay. And don't be tea or soda. Anything else? Eh? Yes, don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. Hey, that was fantastic. You're welcome. That was fantastic. Hey, please. Uh, repeat after me. Else, anything else? Anything else? Anything else? All right. All right. And that's All it, right? right? Uh, now, now, guys. Uh, I, I can see Jorge and also Cecibel wants to participate. And you know what, Cecibel and Jorge, you we are not gonna. We're gonna... Uh, and also, George. and also George wants to participate. All right. Uh, but okay. listen, no, but listen carefully. Listen, you are going to help me by by telling the people uh, in the class where are where are uh, where are the, the the structure that we are studying uh, tonight. Where are the imperatives? Where are the imperatives right here? Can sure. you see? Tell me. I can. Sure, tell me. Take okay. one pill. All right. Think what? Take one pill Take every one. night after and dinner. Drink. After dinner. Don't, don't, drink drink don't, 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 don't drink coffee. 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 Excellent. Very good. I don't work too hard. Too hard. Don't and don't, don't, work too hard. don't work too hard. Don't work too hard. Don't work too don't hard. Work don't work too hard. Only those, right? Don't work too hard. And don't work too hard. That was fantastic. Now let's move on with the next part, please. Thank you. Uh, let me see. I will check Cecibel. Cecibel already participated. You know, you can you can uh you can participate as many times as you wish, right? And also let me see. I will move on to the next part. Okay. I will move on to the next part. I'm exhausted. Oh, to yeah, form imperatives for hours. Here's the on last the part. right hand side of the chart, you can see negative imperatives. Don't work too hard. Don't In this case, we're going to follow this next formula. <laughs> don't no. plus verb plus complement. Oh, 
Now, let me see. Drinks. Now, what would be your advice if <laughs> if you if you have a call? If somebody has a call, what would be your advice? You know, a call, right? Un resfriado. ¿Qué le dirían a alguien que tiene un resfriado? I Okay, one by one, please. Don't speak everybody at the same time. Let us see one by one. Okay. A little of water. <laughs> Drink you. a lot of water. Yeah. Okay, very good, George. Drink a tea. Drink some tea. Perfect. Very good, Jenny. Drink some tea. What else? Don't work too hard. The very ocean medicated. Ah, okay. Have some medication, Carlos. Resting back a long time. Okay. Rest. Uh, go to bed. In bed. Yeah. Go to bed early, right? Would be a good piece of advice. Hey, but now tell me something the person shouldn't do. A person who got a call. Now, somebody who got a call, uh, a no, call, no, no, you would no. say, drink some soda. Le dirían que tomara algo de soda o le dirían que no tomara no. soda. Don't drink soda. Oh, no. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't drink soda. Don't drink soda. Don't what else? drink soda. What else? I drink soda and I'm fine. Don't work too <laughs> hard. Aha. Uh -huh. Don't, don't. Stay in bed. Quédate en la cama. Okay, stay in bed. Stay in bed and don't drink beer. Stay in bed. So don't drink beer. Don't drink soda. Don't drink lemonade. So, but only water, right? Drink with some water. A lot of water. Don't drink. Don't drink alcohol. Don't drink alcohol. Don't drink cold. Don't drink cold drinks. Ah, don't drink cold drinks. All right. Very good. Excellent. Now, now that we finish this part, okay, let's go over the next. You did a great job today. Don't quote too hard. Don't hey, you know, too hard. Yeah, that was the topic, right? Now let's move on because we still have some time and we and we have to go over all of the activities today. Now, over here, as you can see, we have different. Can you see very well? We are going to complete some sentences and you are going to use the words that are over here. Actually, these are uh, imperatives. Go, stay, don't go, don't drink, see, take, don't worry, don't eat, etc. And it says complete these sentences, use the words in the box. For example, a dentist, what would be a, an option to complete the sentence? Um, but but you see i have a toothache uh and then i only call the dentist i need yes. to call the dentist okay we will see if we if it is better to call the dentist or to go si. to, to the si. si. But, uh, see a dentist. Call or see, see, a, dentist. see. see a dentist. See a dentist. See. Okay, we, we will check later. Don't worry. Okay. Too much. What's going on with this? Don't worry. 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 Too much. Don't worry. Be, be happy, right? Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> okay. Too hey. hey. aspirin. Hey. aspirin. Okay, oh, take yeah, to like, to aspirin. Take, take to aspirin. Take to aspirin. And the next one, to school. Don't go. 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 In bed. Stay in the bed. Stay in the bed. Stay in the bed. Stay in the bed. Now, wait a minute. Call a doctor. Go to see it. Well, they may be both, right? But it all depends. 
And so, don't, drink don't, drink coffee. Coffee. don't drink coffee. Don't drink coffee. Don't drink coffee. Don't, don't eat. Don't, don't eat. 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 I will check it because I, I don't know. It may be possible. I don't know. Sorry? El, el número de, de doctor. Y de doctor, you can. Ve a la uno. Ve a la uno. Number one. Uh huh. Well, you. Uh -huh. The dentist, the dentist that, is called. Yes. It is, it is called. It's called. It's called a dentist. Call the dentist. Uh -huh. And see yeah, a doctor. I, right? Doctor is sick. Doctor is sick. Uh huh. Sick. Yes. Okay. So let us see what's going on. Uh huh. Let's see what's going on. All right, cold. Don't worry. Take. Don't go. Stay in bed. See a doctor. Don't drink coffee. Don't eat any kind of wine. You did it. Actually, you did it. All right. Hey, primo, vos te voy a llamar para que me ayude en las tareas. <laughs> <laughs> ah, something that I could see in the in the WhatsApp uh, group is that you continue helping each other. That is, uh, I congratulate you. Algo que, que sí, me voy a pasar un ratito al español porque sí los quiero felicitar. Que en el grupo, mm -hmm. yo cuando regreso a casa, porque este lugar donde yo trabajo no tengo conexión a internet. Pero cuando yo ya vengo cerquita por acá, pues ya veo que ustedes han estado interactuando. Y eso es muy bueno, que se ayuden entre ustedes, está súper. Así que los felicito. Sí. Está súper. Let's see. Now, we are going to move to another part, okay? And in this part, we have the at the end of this part of the, uh, of the class, we're going to see an article about how to improve your health. And additionally, you will develop skill about scanning and reading for a main idea. So that's what we're gonna try to do just right now, right? Come on medication, don't work too hard. And over here, over here, the reading, okay? Now, I think uh, this is going to take a little bit, uh, it's going to take a couple of minutes, okay? But that is important, okay? I, I hope. You can see the information, but if you are not able to see it, uh, we're gonna we're going to have a, another activity in which we are going to be able to see the the whole info. Gives you energy for the morning. Now, two, go for a walk. Now, give me one second. I will. I will. I will. Let me see ow, from the beginning. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Hey, what's going on? I wonder what's going on today. Let me see. This is 11, right? Okay, now. Now, yes. Okay, here we go. Gives you energy for the morning. Two. Go for a walk. Go for Walking a walk. is good exercise, and exercise is necessary for good health. Three, floss your teeth. Don't just brush them. Flossing keeps your gums healthy. Four, drink eight cups of water every day. Water helps your body in many ways. Five, stretch for five minutes. Stretching is important for your muscles. Six, wear a seat belt. Every year, seat belts save thousands of lives. Seven, do something to challenge your brain. For example, do a crossword puzzle or read a new book. Eight, protect your skin. Use lots of moisturizer and sunscreen. Nine, get enough calcium. Your bones need it. Dairy foods like yogurt, milk, and cheese have calcium. 10, take a time out, a break of about 20 minutes. Do something different. For example, get up and walk. 
or sit down and listen to music. All right. Now, some people were just telling me about uh, the, the, the was kind of difficult to see the information, but you could you could listen to it, right? And also, uh, as you can see over here, you you can see like like the I know, but it is in Spanish, right? Let me see. Uh, we're gonna go over the the knowledge check. And we are going to see the, the image. Okay, so we can we can uh, read the information now. Now that you hear uh, different ways to improve your health, we are gonna go over this part. Now you can see it better, right? Yeah. Yes or no? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Now, yes. what yes. what is what is the topic? What is the topic? Ten what is the simple tema? Ways Ten simple ways to your health. Simple ways to improve your health. All right. So now I can see that you are able to see the whole information. Believe it or not, you can greatly, greatly improve your health in 10 simple ways. What is the first, what is the first um, step? Who wants to help me to read eat the first? Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. Uh -huh. and what is all about? Breakfast is yeah. your energy yeah. for the morning. Hey, do you think it's true or false? Uh, okay, I will ask people uh, who haven't participated. Energy for the morning. Uh, okay, no, but listen, you are going to it's tell true. me. <laughs> you are going to tell me if you consider it's true or if it is false, all right? And okay. let me see, Alba, Alba. It's true. It is true. Is Alba in the class? Alba? Yes. Uh, Alba, yes. now, what do you think about the first step? It is true or it, is it true or is it false? Uh, number one is yeah. it, it's breakfast. Yeah, it's breakfast. Yes. Give you energy for the morning. Is that true? Yes. Yeah, yes, it is. Okay, now I will ask another person to read. Uh, Christopher, please read number two. Go for a walk. Working is good exercise, and exercise is necessary for a good health. All right. Hey, what do you think, Christopher? Uh, it's unnecessary working. It's necessary. It's working is necessary. So working do you is so you agree or you disagree? Then you agree, right? Yes, I agree. Uh, okay, now you can say I agree or I disagree. Estoy de acuerdo o I disagree. Estoy en desacuerdo. Okay, tienen esas dos opciones. Now let's see. Let's go over number four. Uh, Gloria, Carolina. Please help me with the number four. Number three. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, that's right. So, <laughs> it is number number three. It's <laughs> thank you. Okay, Gloria. <laughs> is Gloria over here? Gloria, where are you, Gloria? Where are you, Gloria? Yeah, Gloria Carolina. <laughs> Gloria, no, Gloria is, yeah, Gloria is facing some problems. It's all right, Gloria, don't worry, but I could see that you are in the class. Hector, please, number three. Hello, teacher. Please, oh. please, please. Okay, three, flush your teeth. Don't just brush them. Flossing keep your guns heavily. All right, listen carefully. Thank you. Somebody's chatting. No, Gloria. It, it seems as if you are, uh, it, as as if you are facing some problem with microphone. But don't worry. Meanwhile, you solve the problem. I will ask you later. Okay. I will ask you la later when you have already solved the problem. And now you see, Hector. Hector, please. Don't just brush them. Flossing keeps your gums healthy. Now, Hector, do you agree or you disagree? 
Sorry. Do you agree or or do you disagree? It's true or false. True or false? Um, true, teacher. It is true. All right. Number three is true also. It's because you see some some people like to to tell us um, information that is useless. That's why I'm asking you if you consider it's, it's true or or if you agree or disagree. Okay, Hector, very participated, very good, Hector. And thank you, uh, teacher. Thank you. Uh, thank you. It is, please. Can you help me with number four? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Drink eight cups of water every day. Water helps your body in many ways. In agreement or in disagreement? I agree. You agree, all right? Yeah. Okay, thank you. And in the number five, let's see, you have number five. Irving, can you please help me with number five? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Stretch for five minutes. Stretching is important for your muscle. Okay, now before, before, I mean, before okay. telling me if you agree or, or disagree. Okay. Stretch for five, for five minutes. Uh -huh. Stretch for five minutes. Stretch. Oh, I don't know why, why I say stretch. Uh, yes, that's stretch why I, 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 will try, I will try to help you. Stretch. Please, stretch. Okay. Uh -huh. Stretching is important for your muscles. Muscles. Okay. Thank muscles. You. Okay. Now. Do you agree or do you dis disagree? I am agree. I do agree then. All right. Yeah. And number, let me see. Somebody is chatting. Okay, Kenya, thank you. Kenya agrees also. Okay, in the next one. Okay, give me one second. Okay, in the next, we have um, Jorge Alberto. Yeah. Okay, Jorge. Okay, Jorge. Okay. Could you please help me with the number six? Okay. Where is it bell? Every year, the uh, seat bell sends uh, thousands of lives. Thousands of lives. Of, li of lives. 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 Sorry. That's right, lives. All right, very good, Jorge. Jorge, do you agree or do you are in disagreement? Uh, I agree. You I agree. agree. That is really good, right? Don't forget to, to wear your seat belt whenever no. you are driving. Let me see, that's number six. Number seven, okay, number seven, I will ask, uh, Jose Enrique. Okay, don't, don't somebody talk sharing your, your bride for explain do, do a crocs pulser or a read a new book. Oh, okay, Enrique, let me see. Let me see, uh, Jose Enrique. Yesterday you, you had problems with, with microphone, I think, right? But uh, thanks for participating today. Listen, listen to me, please, Enrique. Teacher? Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah, Gloria, I can hear you. Hi, perfect. Hi. Now you solved the problem, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, that's fantastic, okay. Now, listen, Enrique, please repeat after me. Do something cha to challenge your brain. Do something cha to challenge your brain. Now, once again, Enrique, do something. Do something. 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 To challenge. To challenge. Your brain. Your brain. Brain. Your brain. Right. Yeah. For example, for example, do a crossword, do a, do a crossword, puzzle, crossword, puzzle, crossword, or, excuse me, or, for, or, or, read, read, a new book, a new book. Okay, Enrique. Now, you say you agree, right? But listen, Enrique, at the end, 
you are going to read at least two of them. Me va a leer dos de, dos de estas partes. Eh, practíquelo, porfa, porque necesito eh, que, lo, que lo continúe practicando. It's all right, but okay. you did a great job, Enrique. Okay. Jose Luis, number eight, please. Roger Jurgens King used a lot of moisturizers, no sé cómo se pronuncia, en sunscreen. En sunscreen, okay. Sunscreen. Sunscreen. Now I will I will teach you something. Now we we you let us see. I will I will let you know how to um to check if you are using the right pronunciation by using our cell phones. Okay. Cuando estemos en la clase, traten de tener sus celulares también, porque acá por, por lo menos no puedo compartir ciertas páginas, porque este YouTube nos puede cerrar este o no nos puede permitir subir este nuestro video, ¿verdad? Okay. Entonces, tengan su celular en la mano y busquen la palabra que está acá en el traductor de Google. Cuando ustedes encuentren la pronunciación, me la dicen, el primero que la encuentre. Moist, 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 Uh -huh, okay. Now let us see. Uh, I think teacher. Hid hidratante, hidratante. Yeah, hidratante. that is. No, but listen, I, I just want you to check the pronunciation. Moisturizer. 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 Most okay, so screen. now keep it, keep uh, practicing that. What if you have problems with, right? I remember when I was student, I had problems with refrigerator. Me recuerdo que cuando yo empecé a estudiar inglés, yo tenía problemas con la palabra refrigerador, refrigeradora en inglés, eh, refrigerator, and it was. So yo sentía que era súper difícil, entonces empecé a, a pronunciarla muchas veces hasta que la aprendí. Bien. Moisturizer. 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 All right. So that's <laughs> fantastic. Now, do you agree or uh, are you in agreement or in disagreement? Moisturizer. Moisturizer. Agree, agree or disagree? Are you agree? agree. The, skin, okay. the skincare is important. It is important to Okay, okay. Number and number nine. I, I will ask Jose Luis. Hello. Hello, Jose Luis. Could you please read this part? Nine. Number nine. Like there is no calcium. This this uh, your bone need needed dairy food like your meal and cheese have calcium. Okay, now we will continue working with some pronunciation. Okay, now everybody repeat after me. Enough. 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 Cuando se encuentren con palabras que terminen con O, U, G, H, esto va a sonar como F. Enough. 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 Get enough, enough calcium. Get enough, get enough, enough calcium. Get enough calcium. Okay, Jose Luis, you will read it once again. Listen to me, and then you will you will read it again. Your bones need it. Dairy foods like yogurt, milk, and cheese have calcium. Oh, I calcium. Get out. Get out. Calcium. Get enough. Get enough 
enough? En yes, enough. Calcium. Calcium. Your bones needed daily food, like your your meal and cheese have calcium. Fantastic! Now you see. Now you see. You can do it better. Congrats! Hey. I feel proud of you. I'm proud uh, of you. Answer, see, see. Yeah, agree or in, uh, do you agree? Do you calcium? Uh, do yes, you I like for my bones. Ah, uh, okay. So you are in agreement. Very good. Thank you, uh, okay. Jose Luis. In the last part, Jose Oscar, can can you please help us? Okay. Take a time out. I break of about 20 minutes. Do something different. For example, get up and walk or sit down and listen to music. And listen, sit or sit down and listen to music. What do you think? Good advice or it's not that good? Uh, yes, I agree. Ah, you, it's, import you it's important uh, uh, we we do to break to break 20 minutes or, or more or more or, time or more right? <laughs> 20 okay 20 it's all right but if you can take a, a, an hour it is better right that's your piece of advice yes. <laughs> for an entire day if you can take the whole day okay take it Take it, don't worry and be happy. Wow, you did it, people. Hey, I hope, I hope uh, you have learned not only pronunciation, but also a vocabulary, right? That's why we present this information so that we can practice um, vocabulary, but also, uh, oh, sorry, uh, I know what's going on with this is because this is not part, okay. Now that we read the information, okay, we are in the, we're almost finishing, right? Because this is 2.12, we're almost at the end, but we have to uh, finish with this. Yeah. Well, uh, the instructions, instructions are about reading the article and then complete the sentences. Okay, I will ask people who haven't participated, okay? Uh, Catherine, Judith, how do you complete the first sentence? To get exercise. Catherine, is Catherine in the class? Uh, yeah, I saw it here, right? No, but that is Catherine Roxana. Okay, Catherine, you did. I don't see Catherine in the class. Okay, Catherine Roxana. Can you help us with number one? Uh, go for a walk. To get exercise, go for a walk. Okay, but tell me the whole sentence, please, Roxanne. To get exercise, go for a walk. Pretty good. To get exercise, go for a walk. Okay. Uh, let me see. Is Katie over here, Katie? Let me see if I see Katie in the class. No, Katie is not, is not entering to the sessions. Okay. Uh, Norma, please, can you help me with the next one? Uh, yes, to help your bones, uh, get enough calcium. Uh, okay, get, remember about pronunciation, what did I tell you about pronunciation of this word? Enough, get enough, enough. enough. To help your bones get enough calcium. That was fantastic, Norma. That was really good. Okay. Rebecca, can you help us with number three? Sure. To have your muscles stretch for five minutes. Okay. Really nice pronunciation, Rebecca. Re Reina, can you help us with number four?
it's it's right now here yes okay it's right now. Um, ah um okay to keep your gums healthy plus your teeth plus your teeth 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 teeth, uh -huh. teeth. okay fantastic very good. And number five, Salvador. Salvador Galdames. Let me see if I if Salvador is in the class. Oh, Salvador is not in the class. I don't see Salvador here. Okay. Oh, and I, don't, I wonder what happened to, to Salvador. And let me see, San, Sandra uh, Guadalupe, can you help us please with number five? Sandra Guadalupe. Okay, San teacher. Yeah, Sandra. Sandra? No. Sandra is not in the class. No. Okay, and finally we have Susana Isabel. Okay, teacher. All right, Susana. Help us with number five, please. To have energy for the morning, uh, eat breakfast. Eat breakfast, excellent. And I wonder if Edita is over here. Edita. No, I don't see Edita today. Okay. Okay, now who wants to help me with number six? To challenge your brain. Do a, a, a crossword. A crossword, 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 crossword. Or read a new book. Oh, wow, fantastic. To challenge your brain, do a crossword puzzle or read a new book. Okay, now we're almost at the end. We're gonna check this part and then I will switch in, uh, into Spanish just for a couple of minutes to, to uh, remember about some points. Okay, this is okay to get exercise, go for a walk, to help your bones, get enough calcium, to help your muscles stretch uh, for five minutes, to keep your gums healthy, floss your teeth, and to get to have energy for the morning, eat breakfast, to challenge your brain, do a crossword puzzle, or read a new book. Well, oh, I, will, I will stop sharing because we need to, to talk a little bit. Solo nos quedan cinco minutos. Miren, gracias a Dios, aprovechamos, el, siento que aprovechamos el tiempo eh, bastante. Porque cuando yo les pido que participen, al mismo tiempo estoy pasando la lista. Quiero que recordemos algunas cosas. Mañana no tenemos clase. Eh, se acuestan tempranito, descansan. Y este, pero asegúrense de que terminan las primeras dos secciones en inglés. Ok. Asegúrense porque para, para nosotros es sumamente importante que ustedes vayan este, cubriéndola con las actividades. ¿Ok? Eh, se los vuelvo a recomendar. Si necesitan practicarlo 10 veces, practíquenlo 10 veces. Nadie les va a decir nada porque estén practicando inglés. ¿Verdad? Inviertan eh, un poco de tiempo para asegurarse que lo que estamos viendo en las clases está haciendo aprendizaje significativo para ustedes. Yo lo voy a estar evaluando. De hecho, en todas las clases yo evalúo quién participa, cómo participa, los escucho, eh, etcétera. Pero los que al final de todo el proceso se van a evaluar también van a ser ustedes. Ustedes van a decir, ¿aprendí o no aprendí? ¿Me sirvió o no le saqué ventaja al curso? ¿Qué me faltó? Entonces, van a, siempre hagan esa autoevaluación, autoevalúense, ¿ok? Si falta algo, ustedes consideran que falta algo, vayan a la plataforma y vuelvan a practicarlo. De tal modo que 
este, cuando avancen en los cursos, ustedes ya no tengan problemas con los temas que se vienen. ¿Está bien? No sé si hay alguna pregunta, sí, alguna teacher. observación. Excelente. No, teacher. Okay, everything's all right. Ok, este, por ahí también les, les compartí este, un enlace en WhatsApp para que igual tienen la plataforma y tienen un enlace. Otra cosa que les voy a recomendar es, si ustedes quieren aprender eh, un poquito más por su propia cuenta, algo que no hemos visto en la clase, háganlo. Siéntanse en la libertad de aprender cuanto inglés ustedes quieran. Mientras Teacher. más aprendan, mejor. José. Teacher. Sí. Okay, este, José. Yo creo que no estoy agregado al grupo de WhatsApp. No, José. O no sé cómo es el trámite ahí para... Fíjese ¿Quién es el hay un administrador, pero si no, quieren... en, el, en el correo te mandaron un enlace para que tú te metas al enlace y ya automáticamente te, te integregues. Mm, ok, voy a revisar entonces. De acuerdo, José. Si tiene alguna okay, dificultad, gracias. Me, me escribe y vemos cómo solventamos, ¿ok? Ok, muchas gracias. Ok, ¿alguien más tiene alguna duda? ¿Algo que comentar? ¿Algún otro consejo para seguir aprendiendo inglés? ¿Qué les funciona, eh, Iris? No. Pensé a mí que... me funciona, puedes practicar con mi hija. Le funciona practicar con su hija, ok. Sí. Ok, ¿alguien más? ¿Cómo les funciona este, aprender inglés? Dos personas más y cerramos. Christopher, ¿cómo hace usted para practicar inglés? <coughs> Perdón. Como dije ayer. Ingeniero yo... José, ahí, ahí le compartimos en el chat el, el enlace del grupo. Gracias, Carlos. Muy no, amable. Muchas, muchas gracias, Carlos. O, oigamos a Christopher. Creo que Christopher nos dio una, una clave ayer, pero no sé si tiene algún otro consejo para seguir aprendiendo. Uh, listen to news. De escuchar música, música en, inglés. en inglés con subtítulos eh, bueno, al menos yo pago las aplicaciones y en las aplicaciones en los libros. siempre trato de escuchar música en inglés excelente eh, empe empecé escuchando así como que música con un poco de rock o baladas para ir entendiendo un poco, aunque la gramática en las canciones no es muy buena entonces no hay que confiarse en eso sí, pero, pero lo importante es que son nativos, en la mayoría de los casos son nativos que por supuesto no nos van a, a decir una palabra mal pronunciada ¿verdad? sino que ellos Exacto. por ejemplo, nosotros vimos going to y nos dimos cuenta que, que ellos dicen gonna, right? gonna. como el, el wanna como wanna, wanna. Ajá, entonces como son maneras Pueden jugar videojuegos en, en subtítulo inglés también también ayuda bastante eso. Exacto. Teacher. Okay. 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 Eh, Teacher. Dígame. Y con José sí, terminamos. Este, yo quizás lo... José, creo que cerró su micrófono. Eh, no, teacher. Eh, una clave para, para aprender también es leer eh, movies, ver películas eh, en inglés. Ok, very good. So let us put it into practice. Vamos a ponerlo en práctica. Yo me despido porque tengo otra sesión por ahí, pero créanme que voy a estar pensando siempre en cómo hacer eh, nuestras sesiones un poquito mejor. Voy a estar pensando en ustedes para que nos sorprendan y de repente estén hablando mucho más inglés. Bendiciones, feliz noche, que descansen. Gracias igual. Gracias. Bye, everyone. Bye. Good night.